Hello and what is going on today guys, Tomcat here and welcome back to Off-Road Outlaws and in this video we are going to be building one of the craziest bikes you guys have hopefully uh, ever seen in Off-Road Outlaws like anywhere. So we're going to head straight to the dealership and go to the bike area and we've got two choices. We've got this red bike and we've got this blue bike and there's a slight design difference between the two of them but I'm going to go ahead and pick up the blue bike because I just kind of like the way it looks better. I like the way, I like the position of the handlebars and the front forks a little bit more but um, they're both, I, you, could, you could do this kind of thing with both of them but we're going to run with this bike anyway. I think I might want to actually do that just because this is literally just a stunt bike. Like that's all this is. So let's see. So we can do kind of like a frame and a seat. Like literally a frame and a seat. So let's see. Exhaust. Oh my god. That's ridiculous. That's huge. Do I like a hideaway exhaust? Like a shorty style exhaust? Um, I'm going to do the hidden exhaust just because it's kind of, it, 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 it's tucked away and well, hidden. Uh, let's see. Fork shield. You can do a headlight. You can do a skull. You can do nothing. Or you could do kind of like just this weird looking little thing here that looks like a, it almost looks like it's got like cat ears or something. It's strange. But let's go ahead and do the headlight. And headlights themselves. Let's do, oh gosh. Uh, let's do, let's do, yellow's fine. Yeah, yellow will work. Repair pack, no. Mud guard. All right, we're back to the beginning. So now let's go ahead and apply the mods. And from there, we'll go to the actual upgrades. We're going to go ahead and build this thing up completely. So it's all the way, fully built. Upgrade the grip all the way, lower the weight all the way. I don't know how you can really lower the weight much more than what we've already done, but we're still going to go ahead and see what we can do if we, like, really max it out. Um, I'm going to see about doing a manual on this one. And it's going to be interesting because, like, like I said, like, like you guys know, I'm playing on PC, and... It's a little bit weird playing mobile games on PC, so I'm going to try and see how the controls work. But at the same time, I mean, it should still be it should still be simple to use. It should still be fun. So, let's see. I was like, I was going to click tracks because I was like, hmm, it would be cool, but it's it you can't really use them properly here. All you get is travel. That that's that's it. So you could slam it if you really wanted to, or you could basically give it maximum travel. And I think what we're going to do, because we're going to be hitting a ton of jumps, that's what this is going to be made for, is jumps, is we're just going to be giving it max travel. But the thing is, it's not even that much travel in the grand scheme of things, so it, or at least it doesn't look like that much travel. So let's see, wheel size, they give you more room to make it smaller than they do to make it bigger, which is odd. Uh, radius, you can, oh my god, no, can we... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just had an idea. I just had an idea that if this works, it will be... <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing! Um... This probably won't work, but... I. Mm. <laughs> oh my god, this probably won't work, but at the same time, I kind of want to know what happens if I try it. So, we're going to we're going to roll with it and we're going to see what happens. Let's put it on the test rig. Oh my god, let's put it on the test rig. Start Oh my god, that just looks wrong. This just looks wrong. <laughs> I want to drive it. I want to drive it so bad. All right, let's stop that test. We'll go back to the main menu, and then from there, we're going to go ahead and probably go to... We'll go to the stunt park first, because we may as well go to the stunt park. God, that's so funky looking. Let's go to the free camera so we can actually look at it. My God, it doesn't... It just... It... <laughs> All right, let's try this. Uh-oh. Come on. Is weird because you have to go over and like try to click the gear shift and like try to click on the gear shift and change gears that way. Yo, it works! It works. It freaking works. All right, hold on. We're gonna make. We're gonna try something here because I'm gonna swap it back to auto gear gearbox real quick, and then let's go back. We'll go back to the stunt park because I have just discovered something, 
and I am, I am, I am, I am a little bit too excited about it, I think. <laughs> Free camera. I don't know what the hell happened there. I think I may have accidentally touched the e-brake. The handling is so strange, but it, oh, it, <laughs> it doesn't, like, okay, it works occasionally. It works occasionally for certain things and certain things only. Oh! It's easy to backflip, though. It's really easy to backflip it. It's easy to land, too. It's predictable. And cornering is just silly. Cornering is just super silly on this thing because it's just... It's it's like you... It's like you just turn it and it... And it doesn't even think about it. It just... It just goes. It just... It just turns the corner and doesn't even doesn't even mildly consider the fact that understeer exists in this world. It just since the rear tire is so small, it oh my god. Um uh there's been a glitch. There's been quite a glitch there. <laughs> I wonder if it'll do it again. Oh, well, it kind of did, kind of didn't, but we're going to go ahead and actually, I'm going to put this back to like an actual setup that works now. Move it down to like a, eh, a one. And just to keep things simple, radius in the back is going to also be a one. And that will be that. I mean, we'll run that as a setup for now. That should be fine. Yeah, that should be just fine. So we're going to go ahead and take it back out to the stunt park and see how it runs now with everything being like, you know, actually arranged properly. Let's see, that's 50. That's 70. It's quick. It's not slow. Pull the e-brake at 100 miles an hour on a dirt bike. Oh, God. And right into a freaking wall. <laughs> Will you get off the wall, please? He did not want to come down after that wheelie. Jeez, he was just like, nah, I'm here. And I I'm here, and I'm here for a while, bro. I'm here to stay. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, make it. Almost. The look of, of, of total, total excitement on my face when that happened. Up, 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 up. One, two, yes! Hey, I mean, it works for double backflips. It apparently also works for doing that. God, where else can we... What else can we do with this thing? I want to try... Oh, this might be interesting. And go a little bit to the side. Oh, my God. Okay, I was trying to fix that. And I was like, if, if, I, if we could fix our, like, trajectory, then we'll be okay. But that was... That was kind of crazy. And it was... It just... I think there was so much going on that it became a lot more difficult to, to kind of correct the momentum than I thought it would be. Oh, front flip, please. Yes, not bad. Oh, this would be weird. Let's see what it'll do in here. Here we go, here we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. We didn't build up enough speed for it. Need to kind of go around the outside, but it won't, it doesn't want us to do that. It's like, it, oh, it freaks out because it's a bike, I think. It, the, the bike physics don't like being in here. Ow! Oh! Oh! I, oh, I feel bad for him. Oh, God. I mean, I know he's not even like, I know he's just an off road outlaws character, but I feel bad for his face and his brain and his skull after that one. Jeez. What the? That just completely threw us off of the loop. It almost made it. It almost made it. And you know what? Since we're here, since we're here, and this thing isn't exactly built for anything like super specific, I do want to see what happens <laughs> if we go max wheel radius, front and rear. So front and rear max radius and front and rear max width. The width the width will be weird because once we go max width, it just looks like it looks like a a beach bicycle. It's so weird. Like I don't even know if that's gonna even function. I I I don't know. I genuinely don't know. Rear, make sure the travel is it's maxed out. All right. 
so is the power. I mean, we're gonna go ahead and take it to the desert this time and see what it'll do there. But like, normally you would not do this uh, to a to a dirt bike. Um, it's a little bit of like the weirdest freaking dirt bike I've ever seen. And oh my god, it's sl wow. I don't know if that was uh, it's. I don't know if that's me or come on. Oh wait. That's me thinking that I have keyboard control when I actually don't, is what that is. It is slower. It is definitely slower. I mean, I kind of figured it would be after putting these freaking steamrollers on it, but at the same time, I didn't think it would be this much slower. I mean, it is slow, slow. It's really, really slow. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, that's 60. Where is 70? There's 70 miles an hour. We'll do at least one backflip. It'll do one backflip. Okay, at least it'll do that. It'll do that one. What in the? What kind of position was that? That was just wrong. That was just very, very, very wrong. Uh oh. Come on, come on. Uh oh, oh, he's falling. He's falling. He's falling quick. Help! Oh God, help! <laughs> Dirt bikes don't like mud. Note to self. Like, this is- th this episode has a lot of firsts for me, because it's like... It, it, I haven't taken a dirt bike in mud before, and like, at least in off-road outlaws, and they don't like it! They really don't like it! They- they complain a lot. Oh god, oh god, they see it's complaining right now, and it- <laughs> It ended up on its side. Again, it's- It's a bit complainy, this thing. You have to just- oh my god, he's sunk. You just kind of have to keep persevering, and eventually, you'll make it to the edge of the mud. Eventually. He's probably gonna fall- yeah, I was gonna- oh god! I was gonna say, yeah, he's probably gonna fall over, but... Let's go... oh, not cinematic, I was gonna say, follow cam. How about this hill? Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Let's go! Finish it with a backflip. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, that was insane! Don't fall, please! I mean, really? Really? I, I, hey, there's, there's not a lot that you could- Look, he's trying to put his foot on the ground, but he can't. He freaking can't. There's, there's, there's a lot of things to not like about this thing. I mean, like, of course, how unrealistic it is, obviously. Like, there's gonna be all those people, but at the same time, there's also gonna be the other, the other people that are gonna be like, dude, that's so silly, but it's fun because it's silly, and that's why I enjoy it. I, <laughs> this build has been a blast. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to click that like button. Tell me in the comments below what you guys thought of it, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time. Talk to y'all later.